This video introduces wash process analysis, helping the understanding of various stresses underwent by e-textile systems during their laundering. A lot of prototypes, more or less reliable, are available in textile electronics research laboratories worldwide. On the other side, only few e-textile or smart textile products are really available on the market nowadays. This may be explained by poor reliability of lab prototypes and also by very low resistance of those products to laundering. This is not acceptable because we are all used to wash and clean our textile pro products dedicated to home use, clothing or even technical textiles. Because of this, Wash process is critical and should be carefully analyzed to determine what stress is the most damaging for e-textile structures. A wash process analysis led us to following conclusions. A. Parameters that are important are washing speed, meaning RPMs, revolutions per minute, of the washing machine drum, the time of washing, the type of detergent used, water temperature and water influence, mainly oxidation. B. Together with washing parameters, mechanical actions during the washing, such as abrasion, bending, shearing, etc. Wash loading, meaning the amount of the textile products in the washing machine and finally rinsing, spinning and drying phases make part of the washing procedure. In this slide, deeper analysis of mechanical actions and wash loading are presented. As shown in the middle of the slide, mechanical actions that are strongly contributing to the quality of washing are abrasion, stretching, shearing, bending, flexion, hydrodynamic flow and soaking. Then, each of those mechanical actions may be split like it has been done for bending. On the other side, wash loading may be with or without any additional load. In the case with load, it may be cotton, mixed or synthetic, as often written on the washing machine cycle selector. Concerning rinsing, drying and spinning phases of the washing process, main parameters are given in this slide. For the rinsing, RPMs and rinsing time are important parameters. For the spinning, same parameters are relevant even if the speed is much more important and time may be very different in function of the washing cycle. Finally, for the drying, the temperature, the angular speed and indirectly accelerations and durations are important and are supposed to generate more or less damages on the textile components. On this slide, a laboratory washing machine adapted strictly to ISO 6330 washing standard is presented on the left side. However, customers who would purchase e-textile products have at their homes domestic washing machines, such as the one presented on the right side. Therefore, it is very important to perform tests on domestic washing machines using mild cycles. It is possible to imagine that in the future washing machine manufacturers will add some kind of e-textile washing cycles next to cotton synthetic, silk, wool, express, etc. cycles. Also, it may be expected that in the future specific detergent dedicated to e-textile products without damaging agents will be proposed on the market. Finally, the table on this slide shows total time duration and RPMs for cotton, normal, delicate, delicate short, express, silk and woolen wash cycles for washing and rinsing phases of the washing cycles. For the tumbling and spinning, tumble running RPMs are defined by the user, for instance, 600, 800, 1200 or even 1600 RPM. On the other side, normal running speeds are in the table. For each phase 
running and stop times are indicated. Finally, in some cases, interim tumbling is available, and in other cases, it is not. All those times have been measured with the stopwatch from videos that have been made on Miele W3268 laundering machine.